Hello everybody, it's Drew from Langlois Vital Nutrition Center here with you. Thank you for watching this video. Now if you know me, you know I don't like to share bad news. Also if you know me, you know that I'm not afraid of sharing bad news. Just because news is bad doesn't mean it shouldn't be shared. So, I want to talk to you about microplastics in this video. And if you remember, a couple of months ago in February, I did a video series about microplastics. Uh, the fact that they're a problem, and then some ideas, food and supplement wise, on what you can do to get them out of your body. If you haven't seen those videos, I strongly recommend you go back and watch them after you watch this video. Last month in March of 2022, microplastics were found in blood right here in the United States of America. This is not a third world problem that we're talking about here. What we're talking about is the presence of toxins found in the bloodstream of humans right here in the United States of America. Now, this month, April, microplastics were found in the bottom of lungs. Let me say that again. Microplastics were found in the bottom of lungs. They had 13 subjects that they took lung samples from during surgeries. 11 of the 13 people that they took samples from had microplastics at the very bottom of their lungs. Now, in case you're wondering, this study was done at a place called Hull York Medical School. They're in the United Kingdom. The senior author of that study was quoted as saying, I'm surprised that we found microplastic particles this deep in the lungs. We expect because the complexity of lung tissue that the particles would have been filtered out before reaching the bottom of the lungs. So why am I bringing all this up? Because often we hear the word toxin or toxicity or we hear that we have the need to detox and often the people telling us that are kind of hippy-dippy out there, not totally proving it, not necessarily backed up by a study, right? It all sounds kind of fluffy. But in this case, now we have multiple references in our modern times proving that microplastics and the toxicity that they cause are a major problem. So what I want you to do with this is not freak out. I want you to do two things. If you haven't seen the video on how to detox microplastics that we did a few months ago, it's on this YouTube channel. Go back and watch it. Start to support your body so you can get that junk out of it. Second thing I want you to do, keep paying attention to this channel because I'm doing a deep dive into ways to get plastic out of your life, but don't freak out yet. Maintain convenience. Thank you for watching. I hope you have a really great day. And if you have questions, leave a comment below. You know we're here to answer questions for you. We'll see you soon.